So I started to negotiate with Exxon Chemical. Uh, apparently they didn't like it, but in the end it worked out and uh, they gave me a little bit. I can't remember what I was asking for, uh, maybe re-education, but at the end of the day we made a deal and I came to work in Exxon. Now my uh, section head is British guy. And uh, as a welcoming event, usually, you know, a day or two after I arrive, they invite me to lunch and they bring in the whole team and the management team. And, uh, and he said, Munir, I have to tell you a funny story. So a funny story was end a funny story. He said, I used to work with a lot of Lebanese in Belgium. And if you ask Lebanese, uh, what is the price of potato? And he would tell you, it depends. It depends on whether he's buying or selling. So when you start to negotiate, you know, a lot of people here want to uh, decline the offer. They want to withdraw the offer because who are you to negotiate with Exxon? And obviously Exxon at that time was uh, the largest, and even just before the mobile, it was the largest uh, petroleum company in the US. So who are you to negotiate with Exxon? However, because I know uh, the Lebanese way of doing things, and I assume that is second nature to you or that is part of your, uh, your DNA. So I convinced them not to reject, not to withdraw the offer. And here you are. So I negotiated, but the price of potato, if you want to know, it depends. Thank you.